Hey everyone, Nan Kanon here from the Hyperactive Bookworm, here to do a quick review on The Forever and the Now by KJ. Oh my gosh, guys, I am still trying to figure out a way to put the words ah! into legibility. This is the most absolutely stunning, amazing, delicious, um, delicious love story I've ever read. It is so beautiful and sweet. And just when you think you're about to get a toothache, it gets real and raw and you see the ups and downs of the most beautiful love story there is. So let's tell you a little bit about it without trying to spoil it for you. So it is a third person book from one point of view, which yay, I love one point of view. It is about the Teflon Queen, Bron, who is an art teacher and artist. She has the most delicious little meat cute with Kate. Um, she has a, a bench that she loves to draw at and she's drawing, she sees Kate, she starts drawing her, uh, something happens and Kate ends up being covered in her drink and they meet. It's just so romance perfect. And then, their love story. This is their love story and it is just wonderful. So it is so filled with everything from laugh out loud moments to snorting because yep yeah, that's great to wanting to throw my my iPad across the room because it's so real that it rips you apart and the characters you're supposed to hate oof they're really easy to hate. And the characters that you, you're you supposed to love are just everything. I adore Bron. Her story arc, her development is absolutely divine. It's so real and her character just is so in depth and becomes so much more. And I love that. And the way her and Kate balance each other they're so different but they're complementary to each other and the different lives that they've had and how they come together to understand each other without losing themselves is delicious family dynamics another thing i just love in books the family dynamics in this book is just brilliant the heartbreak realness of the detached relationship of Kate and her family and the overwhelming engulfing family relationships between Bron and her family just totally hit home for me. They're so relatable and I love them. I absolutely adore Bron's sister Siobhan. She cracks me up. I think she's fabulous. Uh, JJ is also another side character that I just, I think is just brilliant. There is so much humour in this book while being put in the middle of these severe situations and the ups and downs of relationships and the reality of things that we take for granted or things that we, we forget to notice. And it is such a beautiful package of a story so we have these great characters this beautiful storyline this love story and then it's all told through the beautiful flowing descriptive heartfelt words of KJ her signature writing is beautiful and it just it goes from strength to strength and I absolutely I absolutely love this book there are so many parts I have highlighted, I have made comments of, because I just felt, felt so much in this book. And I sobbed, I sobbed like a little baby, because it was so real to me. These characters, all of the characters, the side characters, the ones you love, the ones you hate, you could imagine walking past them. They are that real and so Australian. So excited for other people to be able to experience this incredible book and this incredible love story. KJ, you've done an amazing, amazing job and you, your writing has just gone from strength to strength. It's absolutely beautiful and I cannot recommend this book higher. I'm not sure I specifically managed to actually translate but I have tried and hopefully um, 
you all all give it a go if you read it let me know let me know what you think because for me it is ultimate love story and I'd love to be able to talk more about it and spoil it but I refuse to spoil the book because I want everyone to be able to read it so go read enjoy thanks y'all